In this video, I'm gonna be showing you how you as a complete beginner can make money with SMMA, social media marketing agency from day one. In this video, I'm gonna be walking you step-by-step step through three methods that you can use depending on where you're currently at in your journey to ensure that you can be profitable with social media marketing agency right from the start. And the reason why I wanted to create this video is because I see so many people just beat around the bush and invest their time and energy into things that are not really gonna move the new forward with their social media marketing agency, hence massively delaying the moment where they get paid. And to an extent, this is what happened to me when I started my agency because I didn't have a video just like this that I could watch and apply the strategies to start making money with my agency right from the start. So I'm very excited for this video and without further ado, let's go right into it. So the false scenario assumes that you already have a bit of knowledge on the digital marketing sphere. You already have a pretty good understanding of Facebook ads or Snapchat ads or whatever you're offering to businesses. Maybe before starting your agency, you've been a media buyer or a freelancer contractor offering your services to businesses, or maybe you've been in the space for long enough to understand the service, how it works and how you can use it to make your clients money. If this is the case, what you want to do is you want to lead with value. When I understood this, it completely changed everything for me. It's really funny how it works, but when we start, we're tempted to think that, oh, they're always going to ask for testimonials or case studies. And maybe if you've already had a call with a prospect, they've asked you this question, right? They've asked for testimonials, they've asked for case studies. The funny thing is they only ask for case studies if you haven't really asserted enough confidence in your service and what you can actually help them achieve. That's actually the only reason why they ask for testimonials, simply because you haven't built enough trust. Now, one great way of building trust is conveying that you really know what you're doing and the type of benefits that they can see from your service. You really want to go into this goal with a mindset of giving, giving as much value, as much information, as many practical strategies as you can possibly give. You should treat this goal almost as a consultation. Give as much as you possibly can away. Do not hold anything back. It's funny to even think about it uh, because I definitely thought this uh, when I started, but a lot of people think that if you just give a lot of information on the first call and you completely give it away for free, they're going to just take that information and leave and run with it and apply it themselves. The funny thing is ideas are not very valuable. The execution is. It's execution. Even if you give them incredible ideas, they're not going to be able to execute and apply them. However, there's a ton of value in you giving those ideas because it instantly tells them that, hey, number one, this person is in abundance. They're not really holding anything back. And number two, this person really understands what they're doing. So to wrap this point up, do not hold any value. Do not hold back on giving as much value as you possibly can. They're not just going to run away with it. And if they do, that's completely fine because they weren't the right client in the first place. And as long as you match that with a bit of sales psychology, leading with value is a great way of closing prospects on a meeting. So that's the first way you can make money with SME as a beginner. Now onto the second point. Second way of making money as a beginner is dropping a massive thumbs up because that helps me get my content out to a lot more people. And that way I can keep creating videos for you guys to just consume, apply for your agency and potentially take things up level. So go ahead and smash the like button and now onto the second point. Now, the second point is what I call the test phase. And this is a great tool to use when they're bought into you, right? They don't really ask for case studies or testimonials. They don't really need that reassurance. The only thing that's stopping from jumping on with you is potentially they've been burnt by another agency in the past. So maybe they just don't quite know how the relationship is going to work, or maybe they're just scared to commit with an agency for a bunch of months. And so this test phase is a completely irresistible offer, an offer that they can't really say no to. And that just completely shatters so many limiting beliefs and so many just roadblocks that are preventing them from jumping on and becoming a client of yours. And so the way it works, is we've got a either a six or eight week trial test period okay uh, trial period now this is not free it is paid right but the price of this is pretty irresistible and the way i recommend you guys price this is if you have a contractor or team members in your team carrying out the service which i would recommend you do i want to make sure that you obviously cover those expenses so you break even it's not a cost you are taking on the client and if you want you can add a 40 or even 50 percent on top of the break even amount so calculate that whatever it is that is the price of your test phase now what is this test phase for now number one is for the client to see whether you can get them results they should by the way know that they're not going to be seeing incredible returns on this six or eight week period right they should see returns they should see growth and ideally profit but they should not expect this insane exponential growth so that's the first thing and the second thing is the customer satisfaction just how amazing is your customer experience do they get along with your team how do you communicate etc etc 
So that's on the client side. And for us, the reason why I love a test phase is because number one, you can get a lot of volume through the door. So that will teach you a ton as a beginner agency owner. You will not only make money, but you will get a lot of experience that is gonna build you up as a digital marketer, that's gonna build you up as an agency owner, which is gonna allow you to sign bigger clients later down the line. The second thing is it allows us to cut the losers. And what I mean by this is, if you haven't been able to get them any returns during this six to eight week period, then chances are you're not really gonna be able to get them incredible returns over three months or six months. And so that way you can discontinue that relationship and it's not gonna really cost you a lot of drama. It's not really gonna cost you a hit to the reputation because you can't get them results. And all you know, it's just gonna be a better experience because then you can just focus on the ones that you can get incredible results for. Your reputation increases, right? You're much happier working with these clients and also you get paid good amounts. The other reason why I love this test phase is because it really forces you to be on your A game from day one. I see so many agencies who sign their clients for three month minimum or a six month minimum. And since they have that minimum, they're not really forced to be on their A game from day one. And so by forcing yourself to be on your A game from day one, your agency is gonna become much more robust. It's gonna become much more quality than a lot of agencies out there. And if you do sign some clients for three months minimum, you are gonna be much more on your A game than other agencies who are used to being just very, very slow and sloppy at the start of the partnership. The final thing that I will say on this test phase is that at the end of the six or eight week period, you will obviously renegotiate the fee and potentially add a performance driven incentive, maybe a percentage of ad profit or a percentage of ROAS. And you should definitely set that expectation right from the start. You should definitely tell them, hey, at the end of the six weeks, if results are great and the partnership has gone amazingly well, right, which I'm sure it will, we're gonna go ahead and renegotiate our fee. So that's the second way a beginner can make money with their social media marketing agency from day one. And now onto the final point. The third and final way of making money as a beginner from day one with your social media marketing agency is leveraging your team members. This is a great method to use when they're fully bought into you. They're all good on, on that front, right? But the only problem they have is that you don't have much experience. And so what you wanna do then is you wanna go ahead and leverage your contractors, case studies, testimonials, or experience. Obviously you should get permission from your contractor before you do that. But what you should do is you should be very upfront with the prospect. You can tell them, hey, I don't currently have any experience running ads, but that is why I hired Lauren, right? And Lauren has been running ads for the past 10 years. She's gone ahead and managed 1 million plus in ad spend over her 10 years. She's worked with some of the biggest tech clients in the space, uh, et cetera, et cetera. So you wanna go ahead and hype up Lauren, make them understand that you are not gonna be running the Facebook ads yourself, right? And thank God you're not, because you've got a team in place that does that for them. And so what is your value? Well, your value is creating an incredible client experience, client ecosystem, which you can show them, et cetera, et cetera, right? So you really wanna make them understand and be completely upfront about the fact that, hey, I'm not gonna be running your Facebook ads. And that is why my personal experience on that space regarding that service is actually really unimportant. And so that is the third method that I recommend you guys use if you wanna make money with your social media marketing agency from day one. If you guys enjoyed this video, go ahead and drop a big thumbs up. It's completely free to do so, and I really, really appreciate it. Also leave down below any comments, any questions you may have on this video. If you haven't subscribed to my channel, there's so much content coming out on entrepreneurship and a 360 approach to social media marketing agency with a specific focus on e-commerce, sales, and outreach. And so. If you don't wanna miss any of that, I go ahead and invite you to just destroy that subscribe button. And the final thing is, if you haven't checked out my free masterclass on how to sign and keep four-figure SMMA clients, it's completely free. There's no say at the end of it. And people have been taking the strategy scripts that I give you in that masterclass, implementing them and getting incredible results. So if you wanna check that out, I'll leave the link in the description. And as always guys, hope everything's going well in your journey and I will see you in the next one. Peace.